All right, so I'm going to show you how to use SoftTube's Amp Room in conjunction with uh, IK Multimedia's AmpliTube 5. And so the application I wanted to do this with was I wanted to use uh, the Plexi Super Lead head in uh, SoftTube's Amp Room, and I wanted to use the cabinets, microphones, and rooms in AmpliTube. And it's real simple. So basically all I did was just load up uh, in Cubase Elements 11, that's what I'm using um, per your DAW. There might be some slight differences, but I basically just put uh, Amp Room in the first slot here for the inserts and loaded up just the head. No cabinet, no IRs, no nothing like that. So just the head. And so then the next thing I did was I'll close this out here and then I put uh, Amplitude 5 second in the chain here. And so now what I did is I just disabled the amplifier. And so you do that with this little power button here. And so if you want to use the head uh, of an amp in Amp Room, you just install that with no cabinet. Uh, and then you uh, just disable the head in Amplitude. And so if I go over here, you have uh, full tweakability with uh, the microphones, uh, the room, everything, uh, the cabinet, and uh, you're basically uh, using the head out of amp room. And I've experienced no problems whatsoever with uh, latency, crackling, uh, the tone sounds awesome. And then if you want to take it a step further, I actually also added uh, the uh, uh, Sunset Sound Studio Reverb, uh, one of the chambers, uh, echo chambers here as well, just for some, some extra, uh, you know, sonic feel to it. So anyway, that's pretty much it. It's pretty easy uh, to use uh, Amp Room and Amplitube in conjunction. Thanks for watching.